Dispatches from the Gig Economy by Ned Daly. What's in the bag? I said. None of your business. I peered through the freezing drizzle across the deserted parking lot. No lights, no signs. Just me and some guy I found on Craigslist gigs. I hoped it was just us. I'd driven down to Attleboro on a whim. An easy fifty bucks to break up my shift, I thought. Pick it up, he said. I tried, but between the dark, the slippery surface of the bag, and the long, awkward shape, I struggled. More than fifty pounds, I thought. More like a hundred and fifty. Open your trunk, he said, and so I did. He grabbed one end and I took the other. There were handles. We swung the bag into the trunk and I heard the thump as it landed. When I turned around, a sodden wad of bills hit me in the chest. I stooped to pick them up, then straightened. He was gone. I sat in the car for a few minutes trying to warm my hands so I could count the five dollar bills. Nine. The last piece of paper had the words, Broad Sound Tuna Club, 3 a.m. I thought I knew the place. North Shore Road, Revere. I looked at my watch, 125. I only felt a few bumps from the trunk as I drove. What's in the bag? she said. I looked at my watch, 258. I don't know. Did you look? No. Good, she said. Now give me a hand. She took one end and I took the other. Instead of just dropping it on the ground with the busted clamshells and seagull droppings, she quick-marched me and the bag out to the end of a small old wooden pier. I dropped my end. You owe me five bucks. She fished a bill out of her jeans, looked me straight in the eye, and kicked the bag over the end of the pier and into the outgoing tide. I put the five in my pocket. I clicked the Uber app open, set the directional filter to Home, and started the car.